so I'm going to. This is Saint Tiraris. Will it show up on the map? Yes, it does, which is good. Hopefully, he, oh, that's that's bad. Uh, oh, fire bite, no. I just wanted to say, I think they are very strong. Try absorbing the health. And now I'm out of Magicka. Yeah, this this will not bode well for me. Um, let me see if I have a Restore Magicka. And a Restore Health, hopefully. Another Fatigue. Fatigue, Fatigue, Fatigue. Nope. So yeah, I'm going to try to kill him. If... Okay, so this works well. Very well, an ogrim, and I can rest here until healed. That's good. Perfect. Phew. So for some reason, I did put the. Paralysis, where the strong fireball should have been. Uh, well, at least that second one, so I can shoot. Shoot to kill. At a distance. So let's see, I need to go here. I was actually thinking that there was that clan fear, and I was actually thinking about um, fighting that because I think clan fears give uh, Daedra hearts. Let me really quick drop a quick save. Even though I did, I already did drop a quick save when I was resting. Okay, so far right. Nothing. I should see if I can train the other schools of magic, though. That's, uh... I mean, I'm very bad at alteration, which is like water breathing and that stuff, even though the spells are good. Illusion is um, paralyzation. Restoration is also something that I should kind of get better. Enchantment is something that might be interesting, but it's hard to learn. Because you need to trap souls for it, so the mechanic is very... Um, the, me the mechanic makes it in a way so it's... it's I don't know, it, does, it doesn't feel like it's worth the time of doing. Like, you need to recharge enchanted items but they recharge when you rest anyway so I don't know if that actually is and I'm pretty sure that 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 um, recharging of items on rest was a thing that was in the main game also I mean I'm playing really in the regular game I mean I'm playing what's called open morrowind which is a open source like recode they like recreated the engine of Morrowind with like late or, or not late um latest technologies so it's actually using it's actually use it's actually able to use modern shaders and all of that stuff without having to mod the actual game like memory hacking or, or even changing the executable. <clears throat> On the other hand, it's able to use the mods of the original game, which is important because it also uses the data files of the original game. Okay, I'm just going to levitate. No, that's the wrong direction. 
we're actually going to slowly levitate into that downwards into that direction until I hit the water. I hope that works. I hope I won't fall down and crash into the ground. On the other hand, as soon as I'm over water, I will crash into the water, which is okay. Especially since now I plan to do this. Oh yeah, now I'm crashing. Yeah, okay. When you crash onto the water while water walking, it will it will actually hurt you. I did not I did not think about this. Um, I should have if I splashed into the if I had splashed into the water, though, I would be in there and while submerged in water, you are not able to uh, do magic. Well, anyway, this is as you can see there also is a boat here, so we're going to check real quick where the boat leads us. We are in Talbernora, which is a village of shacks, okay. So first of all, we're trying to rest until healed. The rest has been interrupted by... It sounds like there is a slaughterfish in the water. It's trying to attack me or something like that, but it can't reach me. Uh, well, I'm going to go water walking over. And we'll see where this one is, go is, is going to take us. So destinations to Vivek, Ebenhard, Mulagmar, and Sedrath. Now see, we can actually go to, to um, Ebenhard from here. Speak, traveler. I still don't see any enemies. Okay, so she was a hard character. So I'm going to use my uh, charisma boost on her. Let's my time is precious, see. so make it quick. Can't talk to her. This does not seem Speak like it is. Yeah, this does not seem like that is the place I'm looking for. So this seems like there is a little shack village close to the tower. And the tower is more to the east. I think that, that is what I'm looking for, actually. Similar to, to Tel Vos and then the tower that's next to it. It's the same here. Only that this village is way poorer. It's just two people living there with a ship. Which might already indicate that the... What is this? There are people here. A little advice. Okay, this is a high Telvani affair. Yes, Outlander, what may I do for you? This is the person that I'm looking for, isn't it? Well, 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 an outlander. And Telvati. Will wanderers never cease? Then it isn't the spirit of a friendly warning that I offer you a little advice. Stay out of things that don't concern you, outlander. This affair is between myself and Therana. I want no help. I tolerate no interference. Ah, Therana is who we're looking for. He'll find her in Therana's chambers in the upper tower. Easiest ways to enter through north facing entrance in the upper tower. You'll have to fly. Either way you go, and the lower level is confusing, so you might as well start through the entrance through the upper tower. When you're inside, walk downstairs, take the first left, take the passage up to a room with two doors to Therana's chamber. Take either door, fly up the shaft, Therana's chamber is in the center. Well, thank you. It was actually pretty nice. I guess they're there to kill Therana, and I'm pretty sure that my quest will lead me to have to fight them. 
So let's see what they have. Maybe there is an alchemist here who sells a Grand Soldier. That's a trader. So what do you trade? Okay. Uh, basically looking for a few things. And if I don't see them, it's like, nope. And I seem to have to levitate again. Yep, that's my levitation spell. And I failed, and I guess here I can't, yes, I can't rest, I need to wait. Which means I need to leave here again so I can rest and recharge my magicka. <laughs> no. Could be that I need to go very far away for that. It's basically, it is one of these, uh, what, what Wonderwind calls cells, which is a square area um, and counts as one like as one area of the map. Honestly, really. Now, now I'm in, the the name changed on the bottom right corner. Now it says it's Suras Coast Region. This means I have crossed cell boundaries. And I think it's always one one whole cell is always marked as uh, can I rest here or not. So this is why sometimes you need to walk a little bit further in order to be able to rest and you don't fully know where it is because as I said it is squared um, map areas like squared units that all have the same size. Now I'm in Telbernora. I, Cross the cell boundary again and what Morrowind does is when I enter a cell it automatically preloads the cells around it that have not been loaded yet maybe even into the a bit into the distance just like Minecraft does with the chunks but back when Morrowind was there that was a pretty new thing this is why we have so few loading screens back in the time when um yes how lander how do you do i need to wait until my um uh see if i do have restore fatigue that's what i need in order to do the levitation spell in a good way i'm waiting for my um fatigue to restore and now i'm able to levitate so it says in the north Up here. This should be the entrance they talked about. And there we go. Now it says, well, they use they use Kwama eggs to mark the way. Interesting. Can you tell me where how to get to Therana? You're in the upper tower. You need to go up to her chamber. The stairs lead to the outside. Don't go that way. The upper room has two doors to the runner's chamber. Take either door and you find yourself in a shaft. Fly up and look for her in How are you? So is it like this? No, this goes to the lower tower and this goes to the... Ah, okay. I see what they uh, what they did. It's like leading any anyone back out because they don't want any visitors. Oh, it's mistress, so I guess it's, she does not want any visitors. I am never too busy for a good Okay, flying up. 
the shaft. This is an interesting way of doing this. Please, and there we have Ferrana. I'm listening. She she seems to actually like me. Oh, are those my new clothes? I have, I've waited ever so patiently for them. Oh, is that my new skirt? How do I know it's not cursed? Why don't you put it on? This is the end of you, sweat. You're wearing me skirt. How dare you wear me skirt? Try calm creature. I should have that. Don't I have something that has a calm creature? Commanding touch? Demoralize? No, then she runs away. Righteousness absorb health? No, spark. So I, I don't want to have to kill her. Let me see what happens if I take it off. If she will. Okay, she will attack me. I wondered if she just if she just uses defensive spells all the time. I don't have anything that I can use to incapacitate her. Well, I can paralyze her. Ah. Oh. Okay, this is... This is bad. Maybe I'm trying to demoralize creature. I've never demoralized humanoid that is. I don't even know. I don't have any magic cup. Have they? They have drained my magic cup before they attack. Ah, that's what has been happening. Okay. Um. Well, I do know that there is a safe game pretty close because we slept before you we went there. Okay, so I'm not allowed to wear the shirt or the skirt. Maybe if I can convince someone else to wear it. Hmm. That's where the tower is. Let's see. I'm going to try again once, and then I'm actually going to stop recording, even though that, that was a very short one. Please join me. Um, though that was a very short recording, I'm going to stop then. Because I still do have some chores to do. And the thing that was important to me was mainly that I have an episode for when I'm in... Um, Croatia. So let me see what happens if I if I talk to the slave. Also, I'm going to save in front of her. That's also a thing I'm doing. Saving. This is. It's an interesting choice by the devs to to have to use the Kwama egg as some kind of 
very eccentric lantern. Go ahead. Very interesting. Let's first talk to this person. Okay, he's basically he's he's a trader. This is her in her chambers, and once the levitation wears off, we're going to save. I'm just going to save. So let me see if I talk to what the slave. What do you want of me, Outlander? What can you tell me about Therana? The mistress is right here. Ah, yes, yes, I can do exactly that. Um, which is bad, because it means a slave is killed, but um, anyway... I have your new clothes. No, I don't put it on, but no time for you. you put there it on. No escape. And now she's angry at him for wearing her shirt. She's burning books. She's very eccentric. She's burning books. Well, ma'am. Oh, it's you again. Well, thank you, clothes. New clothes? What new clothes? Oh, yes, I wanted a Khajiit fur skirt. Are you listening? Yes, pay attention. A Khajiit fur skirt. Tell Feliza that I have already have one. Thank you. What do you want of me, Outlander? She's very eccentric. It's a funny sort of house with all those blue glowing blue crystals. She is. She is. I think she's either high or um, mentally ill. And I mean, she does have chores, but I'm not going to do them. So, where's my 1,000 drakes then? Okay, interesting. I could, I, I was able to take the shirt back, a skirt, and basically whoever I make it wear will be killed by her if she sees them wearing it. Very interesting. Very interesting game mechanic. Okay, so we did, did we? Yes, Outlander. Well, what it may I do? did not update the the quest, right? But um, I think this quest seems to be solved. So let me just head back downstairs. And then, come on. Walk with virtue, Paulette. Yes, I will. And then we will be able to go to Ebonhard to get that contract. Because that's basically what we want to do in the end. to go to the harbor and then I'm going to stop recording because then we can take the ship to Evanhard. That sounds like a plan, doesn't it? And I will just release this uncut as a full episode. Also tell me what you think of the audio. I now have the microphone in right in front of my face. So I'm curious what Therana did to them. 
that they are they seem angry but yeah i'm not going to interfere and there we have it the ship that will take us to heaven outlander or go away I am going to go away by saving. And this means for you, I wish you a very well, a very nice week. We, there might be a, a pause of one week because I don't know when I return if I will be able to record a new episode in time. So if there is none, it means I won't have recorded a new episode um, after my trip to Croatia. But apart from that, goodbye and see you on next Morrowind Monday.